Hey girl. Hey. So guys, we are um, doing a, another Vlogmas video today. Um, today I'm not sure exactly what I want to do because um, I kind of just let the day just kind of take me <laughs> wherever I want to go. But um, yeah, we're going to go ahead and get started. I'm going to show you guys what I'm wearing today. Welcome back to the channel. I appreciate you guys coming back to another video, of course. I love you guys. Um, and yeah, so I like I said, it's so much stuff that can be done in the house. Um, I still want to decorate the office. I might hang up my little shelves today. We might do that. Um, I feel like I want to go to the Goodwill and get like some stuff for the um, porch. Because I think I want to decorate the porch. Then, you know, so like I said, plenty of stuff to do. Um, and then tonight I think I'll cook. Um, and yeah, so let's go ahead and get started. So guys, this is what I'm wearing today. Real chill. Um, I just got my gray like Columbia sweater on. And then I just got like some joggers from... Um, Target with my Adidas and like some little gray socks. We're doing a long hair today and this is pretty much what I'm wearing. Um, and then the bag I'm going to wear is just my brown bag right here. And then I think I'm going to go ahead and just bring this hat because I might put my hat on. Perfume that I'm going to go ahead and put on for today. I think I'm going to go ahead and use... Um, mm, this smells so good. I think I'm going to go ahead and do... Let me see. Mmm, this smells so good. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and do the Ambry Saffron um, right here by um, Darcier. I'm just going to do this real quick. Okay, so we got our perfume for today. Um, the necklace I'm wearing is just like my regular necklace. Um, don't think I'm going to do rings today. So, yeah. And I think I'm going to do my trench coat today. So, here is my trench coat. Um, and like I said, this is the bag right here. Trench coat came from Goodwill. And it's a real classic, too. Um, real cute if you don't know by now <laughs> I love long coats but um this is how she's looking with the sweater real chill but you know so yeah this is the coat this is just a little detail up close of the coat real classic so yeah and I believe this was like the same price as my red coat which was like six or seven ninety nine so that's what we're wearing I am doing warm coffee today uh this is my coffee um, cup right here it actually came from target and then it actually comes with um a lid as well but um i just wanted to get my coffee and go ahead steam it too it's so warm so yeah i just want to warm it up then we're going to head out here uh, normally what i put in my coffee is i put some whipped cream on top of my coffee and then also some caramel. So, I'm just gonna take this. Put it on here. Got the whipped cream in there, so. Yeah, and I think I wanna definitely go get some, um, some K-cups for um, my key ring. Comment below, do you guys have a key ring? And if you do, what are some good um, hot cocoa K cups that I can get? Because all the ones that I've been trying, they just haven't been that good. Oh, what are some good K cup um, hot cocos that I can try? Um, that's really good. And um, yeah, so this is how our coffee look right here. Super cute. And yeah, let's go ahead and hit the car.
beautiful ladies and gentlemen. So, y'all, that food was so good. <laughs> that omelet went so hard, y'all. So, that was actually like my first time kind of making like a like real omelet with like all the extra stuff I had. Y'all, it was so good. If y'all want the recipe, let me know. But it was so good. I am in my lovely bedroom right now. And I wanted to show you guys these um, sheets that were sent to me by Melanie Fine Linen. They sent me out some sheets and a duvet cover right here. And I wanted to show you guys um, the sheets and also um, let you guys know how they feel as well. So I have a king set because I do have a new bed coming. So I do have a king set of the... 100% brush microfiber and this is how the duvet front of the package looks okay like I said it is in a king size this is the back okay and like I said before I'm gonna go ahead and um, tell you guys a little bit about them also the sheets are supposed to be extra soft as well as um, wrinkle resistant and I was really looking for some nice sheets that I can use so I'm super excited now right here is actually the sheets and they look very luxe as well um so it is a very 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 good um quality so and then also so it says extra soft wrinkle resistant and deep pockets they do have a website I'm, I'm super excited because I've never had the Melanie Fine Linen um, sheets or the duvet cover. I did get both in uh, the color white for my duvet color and my bed sheets. So we're going to open these up and I'm going to tell you a little bit more about the company. So, okay guys, so Melanie Company is a sheet and bedding luxurious and affordable company that has elegance luxury and comfort melanie fine linen wrap you in elegance luxury and comfort their products specially made for busy people that value comfort as much as their time they have luxurious soft and comfortable bedding designed to be super easy as well as fade stain shrink and wrinkle resistant 100 percent double brush microfiber and all natural cotton their best-selling 1800 collection sheets feature double brush microfiber and perfect for every season indulge in their soft ultra sheet set carefully crafted in every detail their promise is to give you top quality bedding at an affordable price backed by 100 percent satisfaction money back guaranteed their lifetime warranty covers every melanie product so that you can purchase with confidence also they have free shipping again money back guarantee and a lifetime warranty which is great i will say that i've never had sheets that was actually this soft before so I'm super excited to um, try these sheets out. So I do highly recommend. Like I said, I did get the duvet cover. And then I also got the um, sheet set, which is very comfortable as well. Everything is very bright and white, very clean. And it just feels very soft to the hand. It feels like it's breathable as well. So we love that. When you sleep at night, you can get very hot. So, well, at least I do. So... Um, it is def definitely breathable and very comfortable too as well and very affordable okay so you're basically getting luxury sheets and bedding at an affordable price so that is always a w so yeah i want to thank melanie company for sending me out my duvet cover and my king sheet set and i just love it it's very soft and i'm super excited because again i have not had sheets this comfortable so yeah, I will have a link in the description if you guys like to check them out. I definitely highly recommend. And I will also have a coupon code below if you guys are looking to purchase some nice luxury sheets for an affordable price.
creating my own energy and just like pretty much like just doing me and figuring out my happiness. Um, mm. I'm tired of being around other people who don't want me around them or like, mm-hmm. like not other people like not really want me around them, but like being around other people and they like not doing nothing with themselves because their energy starts to rub off on me and I'm mm-hmm. just like, it just don't feel good. Like when you're around somebody, they're not doing nothing and I'm around a bunch of people that's not doing nothing with themselves. And then it's like, I'm trying to do something with myself and then it's like eventually that energy starts to rub off on you. Yeah, it does. Like the other day I remember I was- So now I was just watching her. It's Yandy's, um, stepdaughter yandy's stepdaughter and she was just talking about how she was back in new york and um how she ain't living with yandy and stuff no more and just like you know how she's transitioning and stuff like that and how things are i can relate to her so bad so like she she was actually she actually 19 years old but i remember when i was 18 19 and um i did not i was just i'm gonna just say that um i am just glad to have grown and I'm just glad that I'm not younger anymore because as I got older, I became wiser. And then I start just like knowing who I am and knowing who I want to be. So I would have to say that's the best part about really like growing older is that you learn yourself more and you learn what's best for you and what's not best for you and what actually works for you. And you really just become the person that, you know, you desire to be as you get older. So, but I don't, I don't know, just like, I don't know, just listening to her just really just resonated with me because... I understand how it is to want something so bad, um, but just can't figure out how to go about it. Um, don't really have positive people around you to encourage you. Everybody pretty much around you just doing the same thing like she was saying when she was younger. That's exactly how I felt, you know what I'm saying? Um, when I was younger too as well. So um, I just want to encourage all the young ladies that's like young, 18, 19, 20 years old to just, you know, Go after your dreams and um, don't let anything stop you. You truly deserve everything that your heart desires, no matter what. So, I don't know. That just, I don't know. It just touched me a little bit. But, um, because it wasn't too long ago when I was that 18, 19, 20 year old. You know what I'm saying? I'm 32 now, but, you know, I feel like the things that we have been through when we were younger really kind of stay with us. So, um, you know, so I can always relate to like a young girl growing up and, you know, not knowing what she want to do and, you know, being surrounded around people who's not that encouraging and not that positive. So I get it. So my heart goes out to all the younger teens and, the you know, the younger ladies who's trying to figure out their self. So go after your dreams. And, um, yeah, do whatever makes you happy. And don't let nobody stop you or tell you what you can't do. Because you can do anything you want to do. I did it. And I'm still doing it. And I still get discouraged. But one thing I'll never stop doing is I'll never stop trying. And I'll never stop following my dream. But that's about it. Y'all see I just made this little drink. I know the top look kind of messy. But y'all look at my little drink I just made. It looks so pretty. It's like it's like two shades of pink. Like It's like a dark like fuchsia pink it's like a light foamy color super cute so this is basically um a shake that i end up making um with some little fruit that i got from target because i was trying to kind of substitute it for um the coffee which <laughs> probably will never happen <laughs> but uh yeah i was just you know it's just a good way to kind of like add fruits fruits and vegetables into your diet and just into like your everyday if you just can't get them through like eating and stuff definitely making some type of like fruit shake and the liquid that i used was orange juice with the vitamin c in it that's definitely a good way to get in your fruits and vegetables and stuff and then you can also add like spinach stuff like that as you guys seen me do earlier with the um omelet which was so good um comment below if you guys um eat omelets and what do you guys put in your omelet did you like the way the mask look i know it got kind of messy but y'all that's because literally i forgot to put the spinach in so i try to reopen it <laughs> girl i try to reopen it just to put the spinach in because the spinach is almost the best part too and um because i waited for my spinach in last so it could be like super fresh so yeah, I forgot to put the spinach in. That's why I didn't look, you know, all pretty and stuff. But it was good. 
I want to show y'all what I ended up getting from the stores yesterday. The stores yesterday. The stores yesterday. Okay, so look, let me tell you why I'm so excited. I'm so excited for one. Do y'all peep this little red back here? I'm giving you an idea, sis. I'm giving you a little idea. Like that's that's a hint. That's a hint right there. Y'all see my little red? So y'all, I put these little bowls, um, these little red bowls on my stockings. They look so cute. And I'm gonna tell y'all, I did see a few uh, comments saying, you know, they was like, oh, Imani, you should add a pop, a pop of color to that black and white. I get it now. Because for the front porch, I am not doing black and white. <laughs> uh, don't get me wrong. I'm not doing um, crazy colors either. I mean, y'all know I'm not a bright color girl. But I think what I want to do is, I want to do black and white and add color. So I think I want to do black, white, red, and neutral. I think that'd be super cute. Um, and that's basically what I want to do. So I grabbed some stuff from Hobby Lobby, but I'm going to show y'all that when I finally do like the little front porch makeover. Okay, so y'all, it's official. We are doing the front porch makeover. We are doing the decorate for Christmas on the front porch. I do still need to grab me a wreath for um, around the door because I think I want to put like a little wreath around the door. I think that's really cute. I'll let a little look. And then I figured like how I was going to do it too because I kind of got like this, um, these, um, like a little space around my door where I could put like command hooks and actually um, hook the wreaths around it and then just kind of hook anything on, um, wrap anything around the wreath that I want to kind of like make, make it contrast with everything else. Yeah, I'm so excited. Okay, I'm done. So the first thing that I got is this wreath right here and this came from the goodwill y'all know i'm a goodwill girl y'all know i'm a goodwill girl so i just end up getting this wreath. basically all this stuff is going to be for the outside so i ended up just getting this little regular wreath yesterday um nothing major just like a little regular wreath uh it was five dollars okay it was five dollars and um it's just like a little reef at first i was going to go ahead and um pull the leaves out but i found when i pulled the leaves out it kind of made it look more thin so i'm pretty sure i'm gonna go ahead and just keep the leaves in like this but this reef is actually not that big and it looked like hold on it, it looked like it's made of wire so i did end up getting this reef yesterday for the front porch it's just like a regular little green um Reef nut major. Um, and I think what I want to do is I want to put um, like a red bow right here. I think that would be super cute. Uh, if I put like a little red bow right here. So I want to do that. And I'm going to show you the red bow that I'm talking about. So I think I want to put this red bow. Which I got this red bow yesterday from um, the Goodwill as well for a dollar. But I think I want to do this. I think I really want to go for that classic like looking sort of traditional but not really um front porch decor when it comes to the christmas so i think that's what i want to do so i did end up getting that bowl yesterday now do i want to add a little extra on there maybe it depends but um you know i want to just kind of just do that and of course you guys know that i got other stuff like you know rugs stuff like that you know i still got the lanterns and all that you know i basically have everything that i had from when i did the fall decorate with me for the front porch so yeah super excited this was five dollars and it came from the goodwill yesterday also y'all i know that um i've already decorated the tree um but i was thinking about putting a tree inside my room and i ended up coming across these little ornaments yesterday and they were um these was three dollars i know you lying oh they bust my head these are supposed to be a dollar oh y'all bust my you know what it's cool these came from walmart look like hold on this is a regular price wait a minute what's the price behind here hold on these was not supposed to be three dollars oh they played me i ended up coming across these little ornaments yesterday i thought it was really cute and it was just like some silver um little like um what are these called they're super cute they were like three dollars it was like these little silver little glitter i don't even know i said snowflakes but i don't know and then i came across these little black little um 
glam stars and i thought it was so 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 cute so i of course black and silver y'all know that's my color scheme but um yeah i ended up getting these yesterday um for a really this was a dollar this was three dollars but i could have sworn this was a dollar when i picked it up i don't know if i picked up the wrong one but for three dollars i probably wouldn't got this because i'm sure this was originally three dollars from walmart and there's no point in going to a goodwill getting stuff for cheaper if they market the same price where they got it from so what's the point of being a goodwill i don't play that <laughs> yeah y'all i had got these right here and i think i want to put a tree in my room y'all it'll be so cute comment below should i put a tree in the room because y'all know i got this whole situation going on with like a new bed and all that coming you know it's about to be lit. i'm excited but yeah i got these for um just anything really they can go on that tree this tree whatever but i think i want to put this on a tree in my room because like why not I be seeing girls put trees in their room and I be like, oh, that's extra, but really it's not. <laughs> it's exactly what I want to do. I end up, um, so yesterday I was looking for a tree yesterday. Now, trees are expensive, right? Even like the ones that go outside, those can get really expensive too. I just think trees are expensive just in general. But I was looking for like the perfect, um, tree to go outside. Because you can, like, more than likely find, like, you know, like, little trees at the Goodwill um, for, like, a little lesser price than, like, you know, like, a regular price one for, like, the outside uh, porch and stuff. So, I did find this tree yesterday, y'all, and it's so cute. Now, what I didn't care for was, like, the kind of green that it is. It gives me more of a, the green is kind of like a, I don't know, it, it makes it look extra fake because of the green. But y'all let me know what y'all think. But I did end up getting this tree yesterday. I'm just going to go ahead and just turn the corner right here. So, guys, this is the tree that I ended up getting yesterday. Really cute. Um, the bottom looks like this. Super elegant. And y'all know I love that. And it stands about maybe four and a half feet. Um, super cute. And I want to put this on one side of the porch. And then also what I think I want to do is I want to add some height and put like a box up under it. And then maybe put like some lanterns on the side of it. And just like some little Christmas decor and stuff like that. But this is the tree that I got from the Goodwill yesterday. And it was actually $20. So this is the tree right here that I ended up getting from the Goodwill yesterday. And like I said, I want to go ahead and put this um, tree outside on one side. And then I want to add some height at the bottom. So that's how the bottom looks down there. It has a cute little base. And then, like I said, it's about four and a half feet. Super cute. And we are going to use this for the front porch. Really cute. Let me show y'all what I did to the tree, y'all. I end up putting these little red, um, the little red. All oh, these are so cute, y'all. <laughs> I'll put like I think I'm in love with red now. I end up putting these little red um, bows on here, y'all, and it just really just made it just pop so hard, like so cute like oh my goodness and then over here y'all what i did was like i said i ended up putting some little red balls on each of the stockings y'all i'm in love with the red but yeah that's why i said i'm definitely doing red for the front porch it's gonna be so cute yeah that's gonna end today's vlog thanks for watching comment below which part was your favorite are you guys excited about the porch makeover have you guys decorated your porch like comment and subscribe if you're not already and i will see you guys in the next one bye y'all